St. Malachy, the 12th century Irish bishop, who in a vision saw the names of all of the popes from his own day until the end of the Catholic Church, has hit the world in an anticipated uptick of who the last pope would be, according to his prophecy. The last pope would be Peter Omanus, in the prophecy of St. Malachy, but another prophecy only days before the selecting of the pope tells otherwise. March the 10th, 2013. Streamed before a live audience. And the world's largest streaming provider. Right now, let's just show you that whenever there are things to be corrected under God, it's got to be corrected. Because right now the world is now thinking that the next pope is the last pope. Look at me right now. You got quiet there now. And you saw the news. And you heard that the pope resigned. And you hear all the sound that there was a prophecy of a, a man called Saint Malachi who said that the next pope is the last pope. And a lot of theologians, great men who never even believe in the baptism of the Holy Ghost, never even believe in prophecy, hear me good? Now these men, some of these nominal men who did not even believe in prophecy, they don't believe that God speaks to anybody now. They believe that it ended at the time of the apostles. And now these nominal men who don't believe in prophecy now believe that a, a prophet called St. Malachi in the 12th century prophesied that the next pope will be the last pope. You can't know that the next pope is the last pope. You can't know. March the 13th, 2013. After a great deal of anticipation a new pope is named. Argentine Cardinal George Baglio is elected a new pope. He chose the name Pope Francis and is the first ever from the Americas and the first from outside Europe in more than a millennium. As stated in the prophecy from youtube.com slash harvest army. The next pope would most certainly not be the last. You can't know! I don't care which prophet it, it could fast for five years straight without eat you can't know by this word they can't know